This is a recap of the day one of the first Hoiban Cup between uh, the a game between Nakamura Sumire and Wu Ming of China. So uh, Nakamura is uh, black, Sumire is black, and they are going for a fairly fighty beginning. Now, when Black makes this move, White's next move was heavily criticized, and for good reasons. Uh, White played here, uh, which let Black take the corner. And this corner is very big, and uh, White has no choice but to Hane and let White cut. And you see here, White is actually in two pieces. And um, so this kind of becomes very, very fighty. Um, now, really, what why should have played is played here, and for example, if Black tried to push through and cut this off, it's okay. Why can just live, and uh, this one is actually not so important. It's just treated lightly. Uh, of course, Black can also um, play here, uh, in which case it's come down. Um, so also just treat this slightly. Now there's a very interesting variation shown by the pros, which is if black harnays, uh, white can cut and black can put pressure on white. And white has this tetsuji, which is a very common tetsuji in this shape. Um, black obviously can't block because that, does, that doesn't work for black. So black has to play here. So white can Atari come here, white harness. So, um, so white can live in the corner and just fight it out. So this is not bad for and it's kind of playable. But instead white played here and this led to a somewhat difficult fight for white. Um, so when white made this attachment, this is not just about purely coming out. So for example, if black plays here, then uh, white can just capture these what black stones at, with this Tetsuji. So white, so so this is, uh, so so at this point, black has to protect this group. Um, some pros recommend playing, uh, playing here, um, but um, black decides to. Um, just honey and then came out so this feels like a good rhythm because um, this uh, black can both play both sides so when white honeys now apparently this is a really good opportunity for black uh, to just turn here and threaten to capture this group because actually the corner is actually a little bit hard to kill it's not obvious how to kill it uh, instead uh, black lost the chance here and just Atari and which let white play this crucial location and black even decides to extend so now black has one two three four four groups and five groups so this is starting to look a bit messy for black so white honeys now this white group actually is actually surprisingly hard to kill because black's got some shape problems here this is not connected and it's got this code here so and so black decides to fix itself because i think for example if black takes here it's maybe afraid of something like this it's so fighting two codes at once um, but but actually this is actually okay for black but anyway black played here which was criticized for being too slow so white ataris tries to fix its own shape. Now actually Black's corner is in a little bit of a trouble. Of course Black can try to live, for example. Um, that's, that, that can kind of live, but it's just too slow. So white, Black decides to attack. White pushes. And at this point, this is also the move recommended by AI. This is basically messed up Black's shape. Um, a key point in the shape and you see that this move is very crucial later on in what it made black into so 
black doesn't have time to just connect and save these three stones so you just come out here try to make white into a worse shape before coming back and when white connects here black has no choice but to play here because uh, if he doesn't play here black can't actually keep pressure on the on that white on the right hand side for example if black plays here then uh, all white has to do is just atari and now cutting here and capturing these four are uh, is Miai, so uh, black plays here but if you look at what black if black uh, even when, when black plays here white can come here and just destroy all of black's eyes so this group has actually no eyes this is actually a really bad result for black and this is actually what ha ends up happening in the game later on but anyway white decides to jump out and threaten to dis uh, disconnect these two stones and black because of this weakness here really can't save these two stones at this stage so black connects white jumps here comes out now this move here is very interesting because this is actually one of AI's recommended moves um, because this is actually threatening so for example if black decides to try and capture the middle one they can come down here and threaten this black group so this move has some value here um, but you know, white can also choose to come out here for obvious reasons but um, yeah but but I think a lot even from pros didn't really appreciate uh, Wu Yiming's choice here uh, which was actually turns out to be a reasonable reasonably good move even according to AI so let's keep going so but then uh, Sumire decides to attack here this is what where uh, possibly potentially Wu has made a mistake of course in terms of the shape white should play here because then there's no way for black to disconnect white but by playing here it left some really odd RG here so uh, you know it's um black can possibly cut it cut it off there's a there's a way to cut it off so uh, but black play here go here this is also okay and uh, finally white gets a chance to uh, come out here so black is probably aim still kind of aiming at some weakness here but it's not 100% sure how we can exploit those weaknesses at this point and um, so once white plays here it's now uh, black's turn to fix this uh, shape here so black plays this this is also criticized these two moves now a lot of pros a couple of pros have said either this which, which is their actually recommended move or some or here um, and the issue is if you play what's happened in the game later on this is there is still um, an obvious weakness here so these two moves didn't really fix this peep so black might have to just give up these two stones anyway but anyway so let's go so black harness white comes out black comes out harness now at this point when black plays here the intention of black is is uh, very clear black is saying well i don't care if you atari me because i'm going to try and capture this group so white also sends a danger here but i think white read really really clearly and white at this point decides to you know just destroy black's eye because if this group ends up do end up being threatened and then, then black mages uh, if this this group actually runs out then black mages choose to give up the tail uh, it's no longer very urgent for black to to uh, connect here so white chose a really good moment to make black into a, a bad shape here so so then white comes back here white decided that hey actually there's no way for uh, black to uh, capture this group so, and black played here this, this is actually often criticized because uh, now if black had played here uh, it's harder for a white group to deal with um, so uh, because white can play here play here play here play here so this this white is now connected can just jump out um, I 
and instead white played here and black peeped now what's the meaning of this peep here because obviously black can't block that just doesn't work so so black just says okay well i'm gonna peep here now basically the idea is if white uh, tries to um come out black can just try to connect like this um so that's the meaning of this peep here um of course white connects here also same idea but maybe what black didn't realize was that black white can play here at this point um now if white atari in, then white can just atari then this peep is can no longer disconnect white i can just come out because now if you play here black can just play here or if white plays here uh, black white play why can this play here? So there's actually no way for black to disconnect white anymore. So Pro just heavily criticized this move, saying that this is basically just a goate move. But anyhow, now Sumir, so when Wu Atari here, Sumir decides to just capture these stones with this harmony. But what that means is that when white takes this white black group, the whole corner is the whole box top side is destroyed and this black group is in a little bit of a trouble so black connects and uh, place here black tries to live white comes out here now this move is also criticized a little bit so they a lot of pros say that white should just play here to threaten black group of course black can live it's not a problem I mean, this is the. This is probably not the best way to live, but black can live if they want to. But that that this actually in. But after white plays here, this actually introduces a problem for black because white can just come here. Throw in, Ari. Black cannot Atari, so black will have to fight the co here or play here. And eventually, black will have to fight the co anyway. So. Instead of killing this unconditionally, this, this becomes a co. So this is actually not good for for black. But anyway, uh, white played here. So so black wants to ask white, do you want an Atari here or extend here? Of course, if if white Atari is here, then black doesn't have to come come down here. White black can just take and uh, it can save this one move here because when the, when um, when white extends, black decides to connect, and white decides to play here. Now this move is actually criticized by a lot of pros because they say that you should just take here. This is actually much bigger than this. Now this white group doesn't look like it's 100% alive, but it's actually really hard for white black to kill. Now one reason is because if white comes out around this area and kind of seals in black, then uh, it's gonna actually gonna be a little bit of a capture race between this white group and the black group, for example, like this. Um, so if black tries to save these two stones, so maybe just do an exchange here, Atari. And if white can come out and disconnect this group, this and seal this group in, this might end up being a capturing race. So this is actually bad for black. Um, Anyway, Wu maybe thought that she's leading quite by quite a bit, so she played here. So that gives Sumire a chance to connect and you know, make up for some lost ground. Black play, white plays here. Uh, so, so when white play here, Sumire plays a really slow move. It just played here. Um, now. A lot of commentaries say that maybe white should black should play here to kind of put some pressure on white or play here to kind of just just put more pressure on white because um the idea of this white move uh, first of all is to give white more room to live but also of course there's this um, peep here um so not so with this peep uh these two black stone cannot be saved because uh, white can just cut cut it off so we have to play here 
and so now these two stones are gone but if white is already is pretty safe with this group and this white group is safe then these two stones no longer is no longer very important because it doesn't cut off to you know or cut off uh, groups that are unsafe so at this point black should really play elsewhere but black decides to protect this area maybe black was also worried about its life and death issues uh, but that allow white to play here black slides in the corner uh, white played play super safe just cutting under so there's no more issues here anymore so black plays here And instead of kind of playing one more move to make the corner alive, a white played, black played here. This this move is heavily criticized by the pros because actually this pro, this move is actually not sente. Um, now so that's white play here. Now imagine if white now Atari is here, connects, right, threatening this white group. White can just push, and now. It doesn't really work for for black. Um, just con just connect here, so um, black and black will die because white clearly has more liberties. So um, so that's why we will just play in the corner. And after taking this corner, and uh, it's it's still playable, but black is doesn't have that many chances anymore so okay so plays here and now black connects uh, because after playing these couple of moves uh, black can actually connect here by atar by actually attiring here connect here connect here um, so black can save this group and white can uh, try to move out or live somewhere somehow um, but this is a tough game for black even like this uh, but it's uh, still playable but instead Sumiri decides to connect when Atari and uh, I guess what she was maybe misread was that uh, she thought that uh, somehow for example if we just do it like this then he has this move here and so if well, Atari then he can actually Atari Atari right so something like that but uh, what what sh what she may have missed was that uh, when white Atari when white when he connects why can Atari here and this is actually Sente um, so if this is Sente um, then this And this and what I showed there doesn't really work anymore you know this 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 move doesn't doesn't isn't sente anymore so it's not gonna work for for, for black anymore so um, so this this is Sumeri's final mistake and so when Wu Atari here Sumeri just says okay like give me some time but ended up having to connect anyway so this black stone just died and that was the last move of the game